Do you know how to calculate the variance of a data set? Let's take a look at a data set and then walk through the steps on how to do this. Here's our data set 12, 13, 15, 18, 20, 28, 30, and 32. And we want to calculate the variance. The first step in calculating the variance is to find the mean of the data set, which means we are going to use this symbol to represent the mean, and we're going to add up all the values in the data set and divide by the number of values in that set. Here's what that looks like. When we add up all the values in the data set, we get 168, and we divide that by the number of values in the set, which is 8, which means we have a mean of 21. Now the next step in calculating the variance is to figure out the differences, and we're going to make a table of differences. Differences between what? Differences between 21 and each of the values in the data set. So we are going to find each difference and create a table of those values. Again, remember that the mean is 21. Let's take a look at the first value in the data set. So we're going to create a table, and I'm going to put a minus sign here to remind us that it's a table of differences. The first value is 12, and so the difference would be 9. The next value is 13, the difference is 8. The next value is 15, the difference is 6. The next value is 18, the difference is 3. The next value is 20, the difference is 1. The next value is 28, the difference is negative 7. The next value is 30, the difference is negative 9. And the final value is 32, and the difference is negative 11. Next, we need the squares of each difference. So the square of each difference. So 9 squared is 81. 8 squared is 64. 6 squared is 36. 3 squared is 9. 1 squared is 1. Negative 7 squared is 49, negative 9 squared is 81, and negative 11 squared is 121. Now our next step in calculating the variance is to add all of these values together and divide by 8 because there's 8 values in the squares of the differences. When we add all those values up, we get 400 and 42 divided by 8. And again, we're looking for the variance, which is V. We divide 442 by 8, and we get 55.25. So the variance of our data set is equal to 55.25.